New Jersey would be first state to regulate how your dog gets a haircut under assembly bill. Rosemary Marchetto said she took her Shih Tzu Bijou to PetSmart for a routine grooming. The pet groomer told me I hope this dog doesn't give me a hard time. I had a hard day. Marchetto, a Northvale resident, told the State Assembly Regulated Professions Committee today. In 45 minutes, they called me to say, the dog is dead. The committee today debated a bill Marchetto has been lobbying for, Bijou's Law, which would require pet groomers in New Jersey to be licensed. I never thought for a million years that nobody had to be licensed, Marchetto said. I am pleading with you to please make pet grooming a registered profession. Under Bill A-2264, which the committee discussed but did not vote on, groomers would have to be at least 18, pass an exam approved by the State Board Veterinary Medical Examiners, and be of good moral character. Applicants would have to pay a fee that would be determined by the board. I did some of my own homework and investigation. There have been multiple injuries and deaths related to dog grooming, said Assemblywoman Valerie Veneri Huddle, the bill's sponsor. And when you look at the rest of the professions, whether they are nail salons or any type of profession that serves the public, there needs to be an oversight. Huddle said that pet groomers are currently unregulated and that no state currently has such a law, though the city of New York and Miami-Dade County do regulate them. Now, Montreal City and Quebec, as a province, do not have any regulations on pet grooming either. There was a case recently that was in the news where a uh, pet groomer broke a dog's leg. So it's not uh, something that uh, we see very often, but it is definitely something that happened.